talking all that on social media. I don't know if you're still mean it. If you do, then if you win the lottery again and beat him, then I not only will I pay Jose who's got to get a step aside money, but I'll give you my purse. And if you don't believe me, I'll put that on my dog. Woo! And if you win, since you laughing, uh, oh, Jay. See you. Jay. You can stick to your promise. You can stick to your promise. You run your mouth. Run to your own deal with you. Stop with you. Hey, hey, hey. I'm going to tell you all my sweats. I'm going to fuck you up. You're going to pussy. I will be Saturday night. Come on over here, boy. Saturday night. You get with all that later. You guys feel me? You got that on the stage, man. Hey, guys. Thank you. This is a terrific show feature that we have. Put me out. Mate? Two guys got to focus on what they got in front of them Saturday night. And this is a great matchup, ladies and gentlemen. A great matchup. And then in the opening open bout, we have. Julian J. Rock Williams. Oh, no, no, no. Get the camera. No, no. Hey, you can have the exclusion. Oh, I'll have the exclusion. Good, What's yeah, going on? What's through. going on? Bottled it. Right, listen. We, it. You, you said a few things in that interview the other day. Bottled it. I'm going to tell you straight up and down now. This guy is struggling. Oh, Joel, let me tell you something. You are struggling. Have you seen you? Have you seen his name? Listen, let me tell you something. I was in Westfield the other day. I got a tap on my shoulder. No. I got a tap on my shoulder no. with a phone. George wants to speak to you. I went, George, who's George? I don't know who George is. Hello? Uh, James, it's, it's George. What? We need to make this fight. We need to cash out. We need to go. We need to. Uh -huh. I was on the phone to him for 15 minutes, the silly bastard. 15 minutes. George, what, what did you say? I what said I that. Say? What did you say? I said, let's go. I said, let's go. What did I say? What did I say? What did I say then? What I did you say? You Wait, the but why did you call me? Why on earth would you call me? Because I saw you because you go missing. Like, why the fuck are you going missing? No way. Why would you call because, me? Because you came home. After You're Badu straight. Jackson. He's struggling. He's struggling. He is listen, struggling. We want to He's a desperate this. man. He's broken. Look at him. He's desperate. Look, he's broken. He's done. He's finished. If you want, you can do it. It's simple, George. It's simple. George. It's simple. Listen to me. Listen to me, good. Oh. It's simple. We can do it, George. I've told you, but I've told you the percentage. That's it. Listen, I've told you the percentage. That's it. Bro, seriously, we can do it. Let's look at him, look, look. Uh, what needs to happen for this fight to happen? And what needs to happen? Let them talk. Let them talk. What needs to happen for this fight to happen? We had a nice conversation, a pleasant conversation. Go on, go on. What did I say? What did I say? I'm on the street for camera. Let's do part two, man. Let's get it going. Listen, I don't want to get too deep into it now. I don't know if I'm going to fight him because the guy's a joke. He ain't got you. Listen, listen, the fight can happen. I'm telling you, the fight can happen. It can happen. Sorry, Derek will pass. I didn't quite catch what he said. Right, he, said he, he said he was going to say what he said. He said he it's simple. It's about the percentage. I'm telling you the truth. This is all about the percentage. Yeah, I'm the champ. Say I'm the champ. I'm the man. Basic. I'm the champ. I'm the man. It's simple. What makes it a little bit it's complicated, Google? Is that fight for the WBA um, belt title next? Well, don't and fight then, for it, then, bro. I'm here 50 50. Don't fight for it. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Don't win it. Where is it? Hey, Gary, what the fuck? Nah, bro. Look, guy, you want to get some guy that's on your team, bro. I'm a real guy, I don't fuck around. I don't fuck around, hey, bro. I'm real. Right, hey, you guys, up. yeah. I, you guys have a fucking get it on and make some money. Or stop fucking talking shit. Let's get it on. Yeah. Because the last fight you had was good. Yeah, yeah. 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 you got it. Hey, listen, listen. Last time we were both here, James did this. Oh, 41. And Bruh, he lost. Bro, listen. I'll yeah. tell you what, I yeah. I'll yeah. tell you what, yeah. 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 I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, yeah. My money's on my fucking light skin motherfucker, yeah, it's my boy, yeah, yeah, that's all I'm saying, man. Alright. Right. One prediction, his trainer, who's inflated him, will pull him out.
We'll pull him out at one point because his pride Jim alone won't let him come. Won't let him come you told me last week you were winning four rounds. Six. We he won four what? rounds. I put money on it. If you're a better man, four rounds, he'll get knocked out. Look, I'll put your purse on mine. Look four at your rounds. swagger. Look at that tire. Where you get that tire from, you fool? Sit down. What's wrong with you? You mad fool? Sit down, Jono. I'm gonna knock this guy out with a four round. He's only gonna get a beautiful styles invest, as well. The southpaw against the orthodox. Blah 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 blah. An extraordinary fight. Wonderful for the fans. Knockdowns, action all the way. Firstly, did you think you'd done enough oh, to get it? I thought I'd done enough, but it was a knockdown. Oh, he bust my eardrum as well. I lost my teeth, look. <sighs> Mate, I don't know what I'm going to do. Still pretty, but look, can you believe that? Lost my teeth, bust my ear, I can't hear. Guy, right? sure. um, you get on with Floyd alright? Floyd's alright, listen, I don't. Every time I see him, he embraces me, he says hello, he's like. He asks you questions, but Floyd's a bit of a weird one actually. He's like, I don't know, he's like, he's a weird one. Like, he's like, yeah, no, yeah, he's just because he's such, obviously, he is the bollocks and he is such a big celebrity and he's on TV, the best ever, do you know what I'm saying? But he's like in his own little dream world, Floyd, do you know what I'm saying? He's like, away with the fairies a little bit. Honestly, what do you mean? Have you met him? Yeah, a couple of times. He's just like, yeah, he's just away with the fairies a little bit. And uh, no, he's alright, Floyd, but. I'm not too sure about the guy, but man. But he's cool, I love him, listen. TV, the best ever, it's great. This is a bit awkward, but I do want to ask you about it, because I wanted to ask you about it for a little while, but what was the don't deal... Don't be awkward, don't be awkward. Oh, what was the deal with comments he said regarding your sister? This is simple, right? Yeah. Right, now, right, so... After the Bootay fight, yeah? I was watching some interviews, some film hype or something. You know, not film hype, like fight hype. Fight hype. And he was like, you know, the gal's the gal's a good fighter, great fighter. But damn, his sister. And I was like, but then the kid, I allowed that, I let that, I let that go. And then a couple of interviews after, he said another thing about the gal's sister. And I was like, that's a bit disrespectful, really, isn't it? Like someone in the box, like another fellow boxer, saying on it, like, like he's got any chance anyway. Do you know what I'm saying? Like my sister. It was just, it just annoyed me a little bit, but I don't care. Like, obviously, my sister's a very good looking girl. It runs in the family, do you know what I'm saying? But, but no, but do you know what I'm saying? Like, it's a bit, I just found that a bit like, sometimes, like he's, he thinks he's so sick and so like, unbelievable. Like, he can do anything he wants. That's the kind of attitude you've got, I think. But listen, that's nothing. It's nothing. So what? A lot of people find someone to do. Give a fuck. You know what I'm saying, but it's just the fact that he come out and said him, whatever. It's not a problem, I don't care. I was just, I listen, he's of course, a, he's no, but he's, a, he's, he's said it in so many interviews now, yeah. it's like starting to get on my nerves. Do you know what I'm saying? Okay. You must be getting sick to death if people keep mentioning the same kind of super mm, middleweight to you. Especially this week. Yeah, yeah this week. <laughs> Some people like pumping Groves' yeah. name, and we done. We spoke about yeah. Groves the other day at the workout. Groves, honestly, yeah. let's go through that again. It's probably going to be on uh, Box Nation. Cause we've done this yeah, yeah. How does he justify that he's number one? Seriously in the world. Like it's mad, he beat Murray, good fire, but come on, Murray and Brophy and then box Chijinov for his world title. Mate, is he mad, is he weird and the head is fucked up in the head. Who did I box? Look at my last five opponent. But I can't even, I don't even speak to these people anymore. And he can't fool people. People know who he's boxed. Like, he can't try and persuade people that Chijinov was some monster. Sorry. You bang ain't box no Who one. Who aggravates you more out of the two of them? I'm not saying they either of them do, hard but one, you know? <laughs> Bro, it's hard. It's hard. Uh, oh, that's hard. That's really hard. I can't even tell you. They're just both annoying idiots. And you know what? They probably think I'm a donut. They probably think I'm an idiot. Like them, but I just think it just kills them, though. Do you know what I've done and what I've achieved and what I'm doing and who I'm with and what I'm getting and what I'm earning? It kills them. But, I mean, I remember, I think after Eubank beat Quillen, they did that, him and his dad did that video kind of calling you out, uh, oh, yeah, Quillen, yeah. after he beat Quillen. Yeah, but you, but Eubank Senior, he's an idiot. He's just like, he's looking, the guy was a rubbish fighter, he was shit really, do you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm telling you the truth. He was rubbish, he was shit, really, weren't that good. I'm telling you the truth. A proper fight is nice, it's, it's true though, it's Nigel Ben. Go and look at his record, went to America, look at his record, McLennan. Doug DeWitt, Barkley, he smashed it, that's a proper champion, you hear me, lost, come back, done his thing, boxed everyone, who did Eubank fight? Oh. No, who did he fight? Who did he fight? Best name his record, win. Can't even give it to me, 
you want me to tell you, got, Nigel uh, Ben, uh, no, domestic. Okay. What? That's it. No, I'm gonna go in a bit more. Who else did he fight? Do you know what? He was a he was a, he was a showman. Fighting wise, he was tough and he was a showman. That's all. Go on. And Eubank Jr. Eubank Jr. The guy's a donut. Now that is a donut because he's boxing the one. He's it's true. That's one thing I agree with with George Groves. Yeah, is that he's insta famous. Goes on the pads and oh, look at that. takes off his top. Got the man eight pack. Wow. Donut, donut, donut. donut. He's boxing the one. Let's go.